All right. So I am trying to put out more reviews than normal. Um, usually I used to do four a week. Um, so I'm trying to get to that. It's just things happen um, after I do the first one. Mor normally ends up I'm tired, but there has been some issues with technical problems at the time. Um, dealing with the new cameras, I pr as you probably already know, um, you know, just trying to figure stuff out. So I'm going to see if I am going to do another one after this. I don't know if I'm going to do that or watch a couple of episodes of uh, a new a TV show that I'm catching up on. Um, I don't know if I'll do a review on it. It's Lost in Space uh, Season 2. Um, and there's like other shows I've been trying to catch up on and that takes some time. But there are times that I just want to... You know, as much as I want to watch TV, um, it's these shows, I want to uh, do put out a review. And uh, I feel that I owe it to you guys to put out uh, at least more than two. Um, but for this movie in particular, it is in theaters, and select theaters, but from what I could tell, and... Uh, it's on iTunes for rent. What the two things that intrigued me to want to watch this is one it has Bruce Willis in it, um, and two the story plot line of it, of uh, in a hospital and she's being hunted and because she, she's a witness. Um, I will not say more than that. I will say. I do not recognize the female in here. Um, there's not that much of Bruce Willis in here, as you would normally think. Um, for the most part, Bruce Willis movies are pretty good. There has been a couple of bad ones. Um, I believe I said that on um, Looper, as he was in there. Um, he definitely, his acting in this definitely felt... Not as good as as you would expect from him. Like this was trying to just make money instead of actually putting a lot into it. Um, I don't recognize what the actress is from. I don't recognize any of the other actors in here. I don't know if it's her first movie or not. Um, she's been in other stuff. I don't recognize her. Don't know her name. Um, but she did a, a a decent job for the most part. There was some, the way she reacted to certain things happening to her um, in the beginning of, uh, you know, being shot and whatnot and uh, injuries and stuff. It was a little bit phony. Um, definitely some phony parts in the beginning. Um, but for the most part, I, you know, I, I, I enjoyed it for what it is. Um, definitely a, a standard thriller, nothing, you know, out of the ordinary, but, um, you know, it, it, I, I expected to at least still to have more better acting from Bruce Willis. Um, it's kind of sad that he didn't put all his all into this, but then again, it's probably not like a huge blockbuster or something that's going to win awards for him, but, um. I, I would say that by the end, despite the the issues that I have with this movie, I definitely enjoyed it. Um, I would definitely give this three out of five stars, if I'm being generous. Um, it was the three is more of I I enjoyed it so. The ending, though, was a little bit abrupt, but um, just slightly. Um, I wasn't a fan of that. Yeah, I would definitely give this a 3 out of 5 stars. Um, so that is my review. If you have not already, um, please like the video and subscribe. 
And um, everyone have a good week. Uh, it's New Year, and uh, for me, it is uh, okay. Good, uh, good week so far. So, um, despite the stuff that's going on in the news, um, have a good day, everyone.